when she went live and um, she was saying things about her husband. And baby, when you got a husband like that, you, you uplift him. You, you brag about your husband, right? When you got a good husband, you can call him a husband because he, 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 he stands his ground and he do what he got to do to be a, the head of the house and a provider. That's a husband. Can't speak for all husbands, but that's a husband. Then, <laughs> here come the pity party. She coming to her daughter's defense. Y'all, it's something behind this. It's something behind this. I don't know what it is. But why would she say nobody gonna bother her daughter? Y'all, this a mess. This, this is a mess. I, I'm dead ass serious. Yes, this is a mess. The daughter come out here bashing the mama and the brothers and the sister. And then she come back and what? She said, I, I will apologize or I can't apologize. No, you don't want them doing your, your siblings to get on their head. Now you want to be able to go to Starbucks and Target and Wallet. No, you don't go to Wallet with Publix and, and it's Sam Club. You want to be able to be free to go to those places. But now you ain't free to go to them places. Because now you're afraid they're going to be sitting up somewhere in the parking lot waiting on you at the door. Now you want to apologize. Now your mama want to come out here and make a video. So nobody don't bother you. She trying to save you. She trying to save you. Yeah. But guess what? Let me tell you something. I hear her mama say that kind of ticked me off. Now this what her mama said. It, it ticked me off. You get what I'm saying? It got me kind of discombobulated. What Teresa was saying. She, when she made the statement her, that, that, that. Pete never did nothing for a uh, 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 peach patch. Why? Why would you come out here and say something like that? Huh? Why? He didn't buy no bras, no drawers, no shoes, no clothes. Didn't that boy and that girl come out here and say he ain't did nothing for them either? So for Teresa to come out here and, and say that about that man, that's the man you chose to lay down with. That's the man that caught your eye. That's the man that got you pregnant. That same man. You knew what you was getting before you got. That's when a mother loves their child and try to rescue them and get them out of trouble. If she only would have kept her mom close, she wouldn't be where she's at. Kept her mouth out them people name and she would have said what she said by her father on Facebook. Her siblings wouldn't be coming after her. They won't meddle with her. They wouldn't be worried about her. If you didn't care about the man, keep your mouth closed. You don't want to be in the man bishopary? Fine. They won't put you in it. And the thing about that, let me say this here, the thing about the obituary part, they probably weren't going to put her in it anyway, so that's why she came out here and made that statement, don't put me in it. Huh? They weren't going to put her in it anyway. They're going to put everybody in there except for her. She can't go too far. See, now this is my thing right here, y'all. Check this out. Y'all come on in, come on in, come on in here. If she meet up but you know that one that be on, he be talking. The one with the pretty white teeth. And she see him, baby. She gonna break her neck trying to get some young. You think Wood gonna jump in that? Did he jump in the one at the um, Jerk Hunt restaurant? He did. He did. What make you think he gonna jump in this one right here? He's not. Peach, you gonna be defending yourself. You open up your mouth. You open up that thing on bless the stank pot mouth of yours. You sure no better get rid of <laughs> Throw them up, baby. You said you got that life. Well, you better get ready. Cause you gonna have to put
Hey y'all, hey, 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 hey. I'm just gonna come in here for a few minutes. I ain't gonna be here long. Time to get my hair. Oh, my hair trying is so great, gracefully. Due to the fact that I got a little common sense. I may not have a lot. And I don't know nothing. But hey, I'm blessed to see this hair in my head. It tells me, Glenn, you know a little bit. You might not know everything, but you know a little bit. You don't been through some things. You don't see some things. You don't experience some things, but you still get. Woo, chacho. But anyway, y'all. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to my channel. Hit like, comment, and the notification bell so you know. But when that purpose, then try to post in the video. Now, what I want to talk about. Mm -hmm. It's unbelievable. Unbelievable. Okay. Give me a second. I'll be right back. Hold on. Hold on. Just hold on.